Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error that is failed to initialize PlayStation PC SDK. So if you're receiving this error, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Make a right click on the game, select manage, click on browse local files. And over here you can see install PSP C SDK runtime, make a right click and then click on run as administrator, click on yes to allow and let the installation complete. This process may take some time. Now once done, you can press any key over here and then launch the game and then check still not working. And then in the same location over here, you can see runtime installer, PSPC, SDK, make a right click. No, no right click, just make a double click. Make a double click and install the installer once again. Now once done, run this file as well, make a double click and even if you don't see anything, now you can launch the game and then check. Still not working, then in that case you can open file explorer, go to this PC, open C drive. Now open program data, if you don't see program data over here at the top click on view, select show, put a check on hidden items and open program data. Now find Sony interactive entertainment folder, open this folder, open this folder, open this and here you can see these files so you can run this pspc sdk app manager just make a double click and run this even if you don't see anything just run it and then launch the game now still not working in that case you can go back again back again back again back open this sony interactive folder you can make a right click and you can delete this folder once you delete it now you can again go to browse local files over here and then install all these application uh, all these files once again install psp sdk runtime right click run as administrator click on yes to allow so run all these files you have to install this one this one make a double click make a double click install it and then you can launch the game and then check so again, just repeat the same process, install this one, then install this one, and then you can launch the game and that should help you to fix the error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel.